we have Lagrange interpolation. This is another way of doing interpolation. Suppose we are given three points, x sub 1, y sub 1, x sub 2, y sub 2, and x sub 3, y sub 3. Then the polynomial p of x is equivalent to y sub 1 times x minus x sub 2 times x minus x sub 3 all over x sub 1 minus x sub 2 times x sub 1 minus x sub 3. So this is the pattern. If this is y sub 1, it will be multiplied by x minus x sub 2 and x sub 3. Okay, Our x will be subtracted by x sub 2 and x sub 3. And then its denominator, if this is y sub 1, we have here x sub 1, x sub 1 minus x sub 2, x sub 3. Okay, then plus y sub 2 because we have here three points given. So we have here three uh, form format, y sub 1, y sub 2, and y sub 3. So plus y sub 2 times again x minus this x is the given x here. So x minus, if this is 2, that is x sub 1, x sub 3. Okay, divided by. Again, if this is y sub 2, then we have here y x sub 2, x sub 2, subtracted by x sub 1 and x sub 3. Okay, so plus y sub 3 times x minus x sub 1, x sub 2. So it will be subtracted by x sub 1 and x sub 2. If this is y sub 3, then we have here x sub 3, x sub 3, subtracted by x sub 1 and x sub 2. Okay, so for this case, we have three given points, so we will have y sub 1, y sub 2, and y sub 3. If we have 4 or 5 points, so say for example, we have 5 given points, then we will have y sub 1, y sub 2, y sub 3, y sub 4, y sub 5. Okay. If we have 4 given points, then we will have y sub 1, y sub 2, y sub 3, y sub 4. And then the format is similar to this one for our x value. Okay. Suppose we have here given x equals 2, 2.5, and then 3.0, and then the f of x of 2 equals 0 0.69315. For 2.5, we have here 0.91629, and then for 3.0, it's f of x equals 1.09861. Now, when x equals 2.7, so that is not found in our table, so when x equals 2.7, find f of x. So 2 point is not found here. So if the value of x equals 2.7, then we're going to find its equivalent that is f of x. Now in linear interpolation, we can solve this one using linear interpolation. We just select 2.5 and 3.0. That is the range wherein our x 2.7 can be found. That is from 2.5 to 3.0. And then we will pick up its corresponding f of x. Now this time, using Lagrange interpolation, we have this one since we have here three given points. 1, 2, 3. So y of x, this x, we will use x as 2.7 later. So that is equivalent to our first value of y. y here, we represent f of x as our y. So that is y sub 1 times x minus x sub 2, x minus x sub 3. This is y sub 1. Then we have here x minus x sub 2, x minus x sub 3. And then we have also denominator. If this is y sub 1, we have x sub 1, x sub 1, subtracted by x sub 2 and x sub 3. Plus y sub 2 times x minus x sub 1, x sub 3. So our x will be subtracted by 1 and 3 because this is y sub 2. And then its denominator, if this is y sub 2, we have here x sub 2 subtracted by 1 and 3. Okay, plus y sub 3, so its numerator, we have x subtracted by x sub 1, x sub 2. And then the denominator is, if this is y sub 3, then we have here x sub 3, x sub 3 subtracted by x sub 1 and then x sub 2. Okay. So, when we substitute the value of x as 2.7, okay, so this time substitute the value of x as 2.7, so going back to this one, our y sub 1, we will substitute y sub 1 as 
0 0.69315. Here, our value of x is 2.7 minus x sub 2. This will be our x sub 2. That is 2.5 multiplied by 2.7 minus x sub 3. That is 3.0. And then, over x sub 1, which is equivalent to 2 minus x sub 2, which is equivalent to 2.5, times x sub 1, which is equivalent to 2, minus x sub 3, which is equivalent to 3, plus y sub 2, which is equivalent to this one, 0 0.91629, times x, again, 2.7, this is, this is 2.7, minus x sub 1, that is 2, times x is... 2.7 minus x sub 3, that is 3.0, divided by x sub 2, which is equivalent to 2.5, minus x sub 1, equivalent to 2, times x sub 2, which is equivalent to 2.5, minus x sub 3, that is 3.0. Okay, 3.0. Plus y sub 3, we have this one, our equivalent for y sub 3, times x, that is 2.7, minus x sub 1, that is 2, times x that is 2.7 minus x sub 2 which is equivalent to 2.5 all over x sub 3 which is equivalent to 3 minus x sub 1 we have here 2 times x sub 3 that is 3 minus 2.5 so when we substitute all the values of x x sub 1 x sub 2 x sub 3 and then y sub 1 y sub 2 y sub 3 we will find that y of 2.7 is equivalent to 0 0.99412 that is within the range of this 2.5 and 3.0 that is 0.99412